In this video, we are going to exclude unprofitable products uh, from smart campaign and from standard campaign. So if we are going here and we have seven conversions in this campaign inside the product group, we have here six conversion in this product here, but we can see which one is has like here. We don't have many conversions to to exclude some products, but I will show you just how to do that. So impressions here will sort with impressions. I see here like in this one we have three thousand impressions, but only three clicks. This means that the uh, click-through rate is very very low so I have to include maybe here click-through rates so in order to see that performance oh yeah it's not activated so move it here and apply okay uh, as I said before, let's do it again, impressions. So like this one, click to is 10%. This means that we have to work on the product itself. People, clients or customers do not click on this product. So this means that we have to change the image, maybe change the content, but we have to change the image of the product itself because we have here 6,000 impressions, or maybe we should work on the search terms. We are going to discuss that later, how to, to add negative keywords. So uh, like some product here, like we have one click, etc. In order to exclude a specific product you have to click here and exclude it that's how it works in the smart campaign uh, the same thing for standard campaign if we go back to the standard campaign that we created before here we can exclude here any uh, ad group campaign we want like for example here the same thing exclude and it will be excluded from the list of advertising so that's how it works excluding unprofitable products but you have to decide which one you have to exclude there are different different criteria that you should work on like impressions clicks click through rates the cost for example if the product price is the same like the cost uh, this means this product is unprofitable and we have to uh, exclude it the same uh, same day but if you believe that this product has a potential uh it should be a potential profit so leave it for a while leave it for another day or two so and if you have one conversion then you can scale it so this is how it works for uh, uh excluding unprofitable uh products